So this is a video on YouTube. This is part of the uh, TEDx Caltech uh, event and this one is called Tuva or Bust. Um, let me give you a quick background. This has to do with uh, a book written by Ralph Layton uh, about um, Richard Feynman's um, quest to go to Tuva and this is sort of related to that. Um, so I want to play this and then sort of jump through the video, cue it uh, to certain points. This is the beginning. You like the hat and robes? I was just sitting for Sylvia Posner. She's uh, painting my official Caltech portrait. My wife uh, Gwyneth sewed them for a costume party Al Hibbs puts on every year. He put on uh, some geographical restrictions. He said, all the costumes had to come from someplace between 10 and 50 degrees north. So I had to settle for going as a Ladakhi monk. But if I could, I would have dressed up as a Tuvan. You see, when I was a boy, I collected stamps. And the most fascinating ones came from a place called Tanu Tuva. It had everything. Majestic mountains, peaceful lakes, exotic people hunting and fishing. Their livestock. So this is Steve Collins uh, playing the role of Richard Feynman. Uh, let me forward this to about 140. Still be heard? Do you hear it or is it just my imagination? Is it the wind? Blowing across the step? No. Is the Or is it a voice? A human voice. A Tuvan voice. Singing two notes at the same time. Okay, so this is uh, Kongarol Ondar, and let me give you a quick background here. So he's from Tuba. He uh, is a throat singer, as they call him. They have a style of singing in which they can produce multiple notes at the same time, which is pretty hard to do. If you try it, um, I've given it a shot, and well, not quite there yet. All right, so. Um, I'll let you figure out the background in terms of uh, how Feynman and Tuva and Ondar and Ralph Layton and all these people are connected. Do a search, you'll find it. Um, look for Tuva or Bust or look for um, uh, the videos of Feynman about Tuva. Uh, long story short, uh, there is a connection between a group called Friends of Tuva, um, F-O-T-U-V-A dot org, uh, and uh, these guys over there in Tuba and it just happened to be that um, I got in touch with uh, some of these people who are part of Friends of Tuba and we got to talking and we said hmm wouldn't it be fun to take a few exos to Tuba and so we started the project of translating um, the sugar software into Tuban found a few people who are now working on it um, to translate the sugar software into Tuvan, but in the meantime uh, I was looking at Ondar's video here and then I was thinking about the overtone business you know multiple notes at the same time and I was like there is something on the EXO which uh, actually shows waveforms and so here we have measure and so what if I start an instance of measure and because I'm using my laptop, I want to use an external microphone just so that we get something slightly better. The speakers on my laptop are terrible, but this is a fun experiment, right? Uh, nothing to be published in a journal. So I'm going to plug in an external microphone. There we go. 
So I have this, right? And so, hello, hello, there we go. Um, on measure, I can switch from a time base, which is what we have here, to a frequency base. And what this does is it drops the line all the way down to a frequency base where um, at this point each division is 500 hertz. So my speech right now is uh, in somewhere between 500 to 1000 hertz. Oh, that's kind of low. That's high. Um, and so this should be able to give us the peaks of frequency as coming from somebody who is singing. So I'm going to go back and play Ondar off of YouTube and see what we see. wait for him to sing and no strumming so in fact even over the strumming you can see distinct peaks in the music there are definitely multiple tones I see two main peaks Let me back up to where he first starts to sing without strumming. There we go. So there you have it. We have Ondar, Ondar or Ondar or Ondar as he's known, strumming away, singing, and as I said, we have a project now in Tuva. So you can go to OLPC Tuva.wordpress.com and find us there. There's our OLPC Tuva. There are pictures of the two laptops that are now there in Tuva and our quest to translate the sugar software into Tuvan and of course get the kids to learn how to do this throat singing business and create overtones and then be able to use measure to measure it
Thank you.